Hello everyone, today I'm going to show you about tuberculosis osteoglitis in spine. So, spinal tuberculosis is a, a condition of chromolomatosis, matters infections of spines and adjacent of tissue secondary to tuberculosis. Most common signs symptoms chronic back pain, 95% corporal tenderness, fever, radicular pain, other signs symptoms are as paresis, hyposis, sensory disturbance, bladder and bowel dysfunction, osseo, legal, osseo, ligamentous destruction, and Granio vertebral junction, atlanto axial instability, and compression of cervical medullary junction. Systemic toxemia. Clinical profile, gradual incidence onset of symptom, result in diagnostic delay. Fever relatively infrequent in tears. Neurologic deficit more common with TS than other granulomatous infection, such as BS. TS has significant high rate of accompanying chronic renal failure. Constitutional symptom history of TB in this ESR plus minus surgical treatment. Quantiferone acid, interferon, gamma release acid. Sensitive, 84%, specificity 95%. Combination of radiological criteria, bone skin, enzyme, quantiferone acid is 95%, percent predictive of GS. Demography, age, most prevalent in fifth decade. Male and female equal in TS. Epidemiology, spinal TB account for 2% of all TB cases. Concomitant, coronary TB in around 10% of patients. Reactivation of Blood than TB with anti TNF therapy. TB associated immune reconstitution, inflammatory syndrome, TB iris, complication in HIV 1 in infected TB patient on anti retroviral treatment. Evidence for increased risk of serious local infection after chiro. Plastic in patient with history of systemic infection. TS more suggestive in children. Hyposis, cord compression more common. Imaging people's vertebrae with relative intervertebral limbs, large paraspinal abscesses. Mid thoracic or thoracolumbar, lumbar, cervical. Isolated posterior element involvement possible. Systosteria or FSE, tissue with fat saturation. Most sensitive for bone marrow edema, epidural involvement. MR best modality to evaluate extent of disease, assess and respond to gene. This is Tituama, a seven years old patient with tuberculosis, spondylitis, and keepers to quality so this ductile chain of two consecutive thoracic vertebrae is anterior subligamentous spear. Note that the adjacent is a spear. 
the spinal cord so malcompression. Bone CT performed for surgical plan confirmed bone dissection leading to the focal kyphotic curvature. The spinal process saw more chronic bone change. T1 C plus MR illustrate thoracic spine TB with abnormal enhancing vertebral body and kyphotic deformity. Large epidural abscess caused severe cord compression. The paraspinal abscess so typical peripheral enhancement. CT exhibit disruption of the T4 T6 body with hypotic deformity and extension of acidic abscess born into the paravertebral region and spinal canal. Only the residual T4 and T6 and flare will remain after T5 destruction. Lateral radiograph show the suction of T11, T12, vertebral body with resulting acute kyphosis. Treatment long term anti tuberculosis medication for at least one year. Surgical decompression in setting of neurology deficit plus spinal spinal deformity. Medication in 10 to 25% of TS, laminectomy and deprimement in abscess of vertebral destruction. Deprimement and fusion if spinal deformity present. Thank you.